Well, a warning tonight, make sure you know who you're communicating with online, especially if you're sending any kind of personal or explicit photo. Police agencies are seeing a growing number of cases where this has led to financial extortion. Fox 5's Denny still in talked to one local agency that has seen a surge in cases. Some of you may have heard this warning before, but Kennesaw police say they're seeing more and more cases of it, and victims are paying hundreds, even thousands of dollars to scammers. Extortion through social media. Most of us use some type of social media these days. Criminals use it too, often to manipulate people into handing over money. Kennesaw police say they've seen a number of cases where scammers convince someone that they're romantically interested in them and get them to send explicit photos of themselves. And as soon as they receive a, an intimate picture or a private picture, they immediately say, hey, if you don't give me X amount of dollars, I'm going to share it with your friends and family. Investigators say in a recent case, the scammer demanded money but it didn't stop there. Initially requested $300, and then once the, the person received $300, they came back again and requested $3,000. Kennesaw police are currently working with several other jurisdictions on one particular case where 300 people fell victim to the same scammer. Oftentimes, the victim will pay up to protect their privacy, but it doesn't always work. The sad thing is, regardless if you pay or not, sometimes they still release the pictures anyway. Investigators say, don't give in to the demands, contact the police. Kennesaw police say they've seen victims from middle school to middle-aged adults. They say, make sure you know who you're communicating with online. Make sure that if you send something to someone, you have 100% faith and trust in this person uh, before you decide to do that. When you send something on the internet, once it's sent, you can't unsend it. While this can happen to anyone, police are urging parents to make sure they know who their children are talking to online and monitor their social media accounts. In Kennesaw, Denise Stillen, Fox 5 News.